The shadow curse is upon us, as foul as I remember it, perhaps even worse. But with the Oak Father's blessing, we may soon see it banished from these lands. He is? Then I must see him. Insensible or not, he knows something. Thaniel is no ordinary child. He is the very spirit of this land. If this fist knows where he is, then perhaps we can save him. Save everything. I will go to see him at once. Join me when you can. <laughs> Thaniel and me are... It's true, then. He's met Daniel. There's no other way he'd know that name. This is just what we needed. Well done. We need to wake him. He must know something about where to find Daniel. If he was able to escape the Shadowfell, then it mustn't have managed to consume his spirit. Well, not all of it, anyway. We need to unlock whatever's left of him inside his head. There must be something to trigger him. A word, a memory, an item. We just need to find it. I'm afraid so, yes. Let's check his person. There might be something on him to help us get started. I don't deserve you, my friend. <laughs> Thank you. name. He must know more. We need to rouse him. Good. Its music might help restore him. Show it to him. Trapped there. He needs help. Calm. Breathe. <laughs> You've been trapped in the shadow fell for a century. Take a moment to clear your mind. A century? You're Halsin. Thaniel said to find you. You must help him. Please. I will. But I need to know where Thaniel is. If I venture into the shadow fell blind, I will never find him. I'm not sure I can put it into words. The landscape there shifts and changes. Lavender. Whenever I saw Thaniel, I always smelled lavender. I can work with that. Rest now. Meet me by the lake shore. I have what we need to proceed, but I'll need your help. Be ready. This may prove perilous. You're here. Good. Now we can begin. Thaniel is trapped in the Shadowfell. But thanks to your efforts, I know where to look. Now I must go there, alone. No. This opportunity has been a hundred years in the making. It has to be me. And only me. But I didn't bring you here to witness an old druid's grandstanding. You have a part to play in this. And I trust you will play it well. With the Oak Father's blessing, I can infiltrate the Shadowfell, but doing so will sap my strength. 
I'll need your help if I'm to return. I need you to stay here, keep the portal open until I return, and defend it at all costs. The shadows won't be banished without a fight. Once I open the portal, they'll swarm like carrion birds and try to destroy it. You must not let that happen. Let's begin. Whatever happens, do not attempt to enter the portal, and do not let anything interfere with it. It took me years of study, of seeking the Oak Father's favor, to find a way to part the veil. Pray that this works. Oak Father, hear me, aid me, force open the jaws of darkness. Make passage for your vessel of light. It's ready. I'll return with Thaniel as soon as possible. Stay close to the portal. Buy me what time you can. It's done. I have him. But something's wrong. Dreadfully wrong. No. It can't be. No. But some part of him is... missing. He's... hollow. I need to examine him back at the camp. Come see us when you can. Thaniel is resting, but it's no easy slumber. I discovered what's wrong with him. The shadows rendered him in two when they bore him away to the Shadowfell. Half of his essence remained here, amidst the curse. What stayed behind would have been the strongest part of him. But after all these years left in the darkness, corruption must have taken hold. It's both simple and not. We need to find Thaniel's missing half and make him whole again. Only the missing half may not come willingly. The curse will have sunk its tendrils deep, twisting Thaniel's essence into something else. No matter how it's been twisted by the shadows, it is still part of Thaniel's essence. It will resemble him somehow, and may show signs of his power. Look for signs of life in the darkness, wildflowers where everything else is dead. The curse cannot subdue the power Thaniel bears. Not entirely. In fact, I saw just the sort before, not long after we first came within reach of the Shadow Curse. Fool that I am, I did not grasp their significance at the time. There is a ruin some way outside of Last Light. I caught a glimpse of fresh blooms there, but did not investigate further. I shall mark it upon your map. And you saw this boy yourself? That can't be a coincidence, but we need to be sure. And I truly mean we, if you wish. Every moment counts, and I've asked much of you already without being at your side. If you want me, I'm yours. Against the curse, against the absolute... Anything. Just say the word. Good. Now our roots can deepen. Together. I won fair and square. There's no point in playing again. I want a challenge. Though shrouded in shadows, the child's resemblance to Thaniel is unmistakable. This must be his dark half, warped by the curse. Go on, find someone else to play with. Spoil sport. I'm not going back. I like it here. I've made a family for myself. I get to play all the time. Yes, 
Yes, I do. You can't make me do anything. <laughs> I don't want to play with you anymore. He's fled. We need to track him down. Wherever the curse is the strongest, that's where he'll go. That's where he'll feel safe. Why couldn't you just leave me alone? Why can't I just stay here, playing? I had everything I've ever wanted, right here! And you've ruined it! I'm not leaving. You can't make me. Be gentle. He's much more than a child. But he doesn't truly know that. It shall be done. Oliver, nobody is making you leave. This is your home. But it is dark, empty, lonely. I don't want you to be alone. I want you to be with Daniel. Why should I go back to him? He abandoned me. No, you were stolen from each other. Neither of you are to blame. And I know your pain. I truly do. Thaniel was my friend also. I played with him, grew up while he stayed the same. He made me who I am today. And then he was ripped away from me. Same as for you. But you need not be alone any longer. You need not invent friends. Thaniel is back. He is waiting for you. Fine. I'll do it. It might be nice to be with him again. Bye. And thank you for playing with me. It's done, at last. Soon the land will be unshrouded. We should return to Thaniel when we can. The druid Halsin spoke to me while I was sleeping. He spoke of you. Said that you fought Shadow and Spike to restore me. A hundred years of sickness almost ended. I feel every root that riddles the earth beginning to unfold. But there is one anchor, still holding the shadows in place. The soul that brought it into being, for the land to heal. Ketherick Thorne must die. Oakfather preserve you. Honestly, I never thought I'd make it that far. But the Absolute is a threat to all, and I promised I'd help you with your parasite. So, I'll remain with you. If you'll have me, that is. So do I. But one duty at a time. Druids and Harpers joined together to put a stop to Catherick Thorm. We marched on Moonrise, and after much fighting, we prevailed. Even in defeat, though, Catherick turned to Shah. Not long after we sealed him away in his tomb, the Shadow Curse took hold. No one had seen the likes of it before. No one knew how to react. Then it started to claim all those within its reach. Those who had survived the battles now fell to the shadows, became part of the shadows. And worst of all, I lost contact with Thaniel. I wanted to try and find him, but we couldn't stay. We would have all succumbed. When the Archdruid of the Grove, my predecessor, was seized by the curse. I had to lead the survivors to safety. That was my first day as Archdruid. An inauspicious beginning. You are right, but 
I must not lose focus until everything has been put right. I've wasted too much time already. Years in which nature has suffered. Nathaniel rests well. He's healing very rapidly, now that Oliver has returned to him. No more than my right hand can absorb my left. Oliver is helping Thaniel to recover. They both lie dormant, like trees awaiting spring. Once the curse is lifted, they can stand as one or as a pair. Whatever they wish, I hope they will remain as a pair. It will be good for them both to have a friend, once I'm gone. Still, I would like to return here someday. See Thaniel and Oliver again. In my meditations, or perhaps in person, if the Oak Father wills it. I hope he does. But perhaps there is more that I want. Anyway, once the curse is lifted, nature can take its course without me. I belong at your side. Not what? Who? But all in due course. I can't say for certain, but... We'll see it come to pass long before this place recedes behind us. Don't worry. All is at hand. We can depart whenever you're ready.